let's say matrix A is 3, negative 6, 5, 2. And matrix B has the elements 7, 4, negative 5, and 8. Now let's say we're given the equation 3a plus x is equal to 2b. What is the value of x? So x represents a matrix, and we need to calculate the value of this matrix. The first thing we need to do is solve for x in this equation. And we can do that if we subtract both sides by 3a. So matrix X is going to be 2B minus 3A. So all we need to do is perform the operations on matrices B and A according to that equation. And that will give us matrix X. So what is the value of 3B, I mean 2B rather, minus 3A? So we need to multiply matrix B by 2, and then subtract it by 3 times the value of matrix A. So 2 times 7 is 14, and then 2 times 4 is 8. 2 times negative 5, that's negative 10. 2 times 8 is 16. So basically, we simply need to double everything in that matrix. Now for the second one, I'm going to multiply this matrix by negative 3. If I do that, since I used up the negative sign, a positive sign will be left over. So negative 3 times 3 is negative 9. Negative 3 times negative 6, that's positive 18. And then negative 3 times 5, negative 15. And negative 3 times 2 is negative 6. So now all I need to do is add uh, these two uh, matrices. So matrix X is going to have the following values. So first, let's add 14 and negative 9, which is the same as 14 minus 9, so that's going to be 5. And then we have 8 plus 18, which is 26. And then negative 10 plus negative 15, that's negative 25. And then 16 plus negative 6, which is 10. And so that's the value of matrix X. So that's how you can solve for the missing matrix. Now let's work on another example. So let's say we have matrix A. It has the numbers 2, 7, negative 4, 5, negative 3, and 9. And matrix B is also going to be a 2 by 3 matrix. It's going to have two rows, three columns. So let's say it's 4, negative 6, 5, negative 2, 1, and 3. And here is the equation. We're going to say that 6a minus 2x is equal to 4b. So determine all of the elements in matrix x. So let's solve for x. Let's subtract both sides by 6a. And so we can see that negative 2x is equal to 4b minus 6a. And then let's divide every term by negative 2. So x is going to equal 4 divided by negative 2 is negative 2. Negative 6 divided by negative 2 is positive 3. So I'm going to reverse 3a and negative 2b. So matrix x is equal to 3a minus 2b. And so that's going to be 3 times matrix A. Minus 2 times matrix B. So let's perform the operation. Let's multiply matrix A by 3. So this is going to be 6, 21, negative 12, 15, negative 9, and 27, if we triple the value of every element in that matrix.
Now, let's multiply every element in this matrix by negative 2. So it's going to be negative 8, 12, negative 10, 4, negative 2, and negative 6. Now, let's add the two matrices that we now have. So first we have 6 plus negative 8, which is going to be negative 2. And then 21 plus 12, that's 33. And then negative 12 plus negative 10, that's a negative 22. 15 plus 4 is 19. And negative 9 plus negative 2, that's going to be negative 11. And finally, 27 plus negative 6 is 21. And that's it. So now you know how to solve for a missing matrix in an equation. So thanks for watching this video.